So today, back in one of my favourite places, Avon Valley, and I'm in one of my favourite spots as well, overlooking the valley all the way down to the ocean. I haven't got a lot of time today for a hike, but I brought the essentials with me, made sure I've got enough for a cup of tea, but today's going to be something a bit different. So, if you've seen any of my videos, you'd know that I've used the MSR Pocket Rocket Deluxe, uh, sorry, Pocket Rocket 2, sorry, uh, for uh, probably the last year, 18 months or so. But one thing, as probably anyone who's uh, who's been out in the colder months has noticed, gas power stoves, they do tend to struggle uh, as the temperature reaches uh, zero and below. So, seeing as I am planning on getting out uh, at least uh, a couple of times in uh, in the winter, I'm going to try something that was given to me probably more than a year ago and it sat in the cupboard I've never ever tried it and it's a BCB stove it comes with these oh well I've given these with them at least I should say uh, fire dragon uh, gel fuel so plan is boil up a little bit of water have a nice cup of tea and enjoy that view so something like this is as simple as it comes just Fold out the edges, it does come with a little uh, baffle plate that's uh, supposed to be a little bit more wind resistant but I'm not quite sure, especially given how, uh, how blustery it is today. Gel capsules themselves, uh, they're by Fire Dragon, uh, which I only recently found out is actually a Welsh company, I think they're based in Cardiff, so flying a flag. So. Not having ever used one of these before, I don't know what to expect really. But the stove itself, you can't get any simpler. In goes the gel. Now, considering I have no idea on burn times or anything like that for this, I'm going to make sure that my water is all ready to go. Uh, I did actually forget to bring water, which is kind of a stupid thing to do considering you're supposed to be making a cup of tea, so I had to stop off in the co-op on the way. And then hopefully, just light it. Just got to make sure it's uh, it's burning. It's very very clean flame, so plenty of heat coming off that. I'm actually quite surprised how hot that is. So I'm not going to time it or anything. I'm not in any sort of rush. So I'm already seeing a couple of potential negatives. The gels themselves, they come in these little plastic containers, which just means there's another thing for you to make sure you take away when you leave. Uh, obviously you have no control over temperature, over burn time. So I think something like this is probably going to be more suited to just boiling water. You might get away with uh, a little cook up on a frying pan of some bacon and sausage but again depends if you've got the time to to make anything with it but really simple literally can't go wrong with it just fold it out gel in and sit and chill tell you what it's not been going long I was already starting to see some steam coming off it I know it's a bit of a cold day but I'm really impressed and considering that water is out of the fridge in co-op it's doing a pretty good job so that only took about five minutes maybe a bit less now i would say there's only about 250 ml of water in there so I'm not expecting any miracles for you know a big batch and I'm definitely going to have to get some kind of uh, pot grippers because that handle is a little bit warm. It's not too bad. But yeah, that's not so bad considering how simple it is. So I'm going to leave that burn off, get my brew going. Tried this lately as well. Tea granules. 
another thing when I uh, I go out using tea bags just again it's another thing to try and uh, take away in rubbish but I thought I'd give these a try if uh, use them maybe the last month or so and they're not anywhere near as bad as I thought it's just a case of you put about a teaspoon in same as you would with your coffee and then I always bring one of these little Nalgene bottles with a little bit of milk in I used to use powdered milk and I still do if I'm doing multi days but just for a one off hour out the house it ain't gonna go off so that's it nice and short nice and simple today just a first look at the BCB stove I'm gonna sit cup of tea and enjoy that view